He's, he's going to kick me off of the stand if I talk more than five minutes. Oh. <laughs> so there won't, actually, that's a lot more than the 30 second sound bites that we are expected to do on these forums night after night. Uh, and so it's a pleasure. And I, I can't tell you how gratifying it is for me, as your candidate for mayor, to see all of you here in this beautiful garden, this park of the home of Kay Bullitt. I've been here many times before. I've been to many other candidate events here and political e events. And uh, I can't say enough about how dear and important Kay is to me for her leadership uh, throughout the, my entire life and much uh, beyond that. Kay, uh, we honor you today for all that you've done and have done for our city, for children, for education, yeah. for civil rights, for peace. Yeah. 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 Uh, and I do need to also thank uh, my family. My son, Mason, is here. And my, uh, uh, some of my in-laws are here. And my brothers and sisters, my staff, my incredible volunteers. How many volunteers do we have now? Robert, we've got a lot of volunteers, <laughs> and I'm very proud of that. This is a different kind of a campaign than you'll see with the rest of the candidates, and it's going to continue this way. It's going to build momentum and strength, strength in people like you and me and all of us here. Uh, so um, where am I going with this? It's uh, <laughs> I want to just tell you that there are candidates and there are political leaders who you might say are ambition driven and there are mission driven and it takes a bit of both obviously to be you know to be a candidate to be successful and to be successful in office you have to have ambition um, but my ambition is to make the city the world a better place it's not about ambition for myself as a candidate or for mayor or for a title that is what motivates me, is to make our city a better place, a city for all.